Hi guys, I hope you're doing well. This is Nina here. So, uh, some of you might be thinking I've disappeared or, <laughs> you know, I've maybe scooted off to some other realm or something. That's not the case. How I wish. Um, mm -hmm. But uh, yes, I wanted to give you a bit of a, an update. Um, apologies for not posting the monthlies um, for September. Uh, if I can manage, I'll probably do the mid-month readings, okay? But um, I wanted to let you know about certain developments, certain things that I have been uh, reflecting on. So I've taken a bit of time out to basically think uh, things through and to even get more guidance on what kind of um, work I want to do here, okay? So, um, without taking myself too seriously, I do feel like I have some responsibility uh, when I'm putting content out there for it to be genuine, for it to be authentic, for it to be something that is in alignment with uh, who I am, okay? So that's one reason why I'm not uh, planning to do any uh, um, monthly love readings for now because i'm not really feeling inclined to do them and first of all thank you so much for uh, participating in the poll that i did uh, a couple of days back and for giving me some really good suggestions on the kind of videos that you want to see and i feel really grateful to have uh, uh, subscribers who want to see more meaningful stuff you know like uh, uh, things that have to do with yourself and the responsibility that you have in terms of creating your own reality so uh, what steps you need to take or things topics like um, I think Elizabeth had uh, suggested something like uh, I have made a note of these topics okay but it was on the lines of uh, what changes you need to make to um, usher in a new path okay or a new beginning so things like that i really like doing as well because uh, they're not predictive in nature first of all so if you're someone who is uh, addicted to prediction it's perfectly fine okay it's uh, not a vice but it's just that you're limiting tarot to that fortune telling element Although there's so much, there's a whole other side to it that you can completely delve into and make use of and um, especially to discover yourself and to heal yourself, okay? And that's where I feel uh, I'm also being guided to focus on, okay? So another kind of videos that I have been receiving guidance to do is uh, messages from your angels messages from your ancestors and passed on loved ones earlier i to be honest i wanted to or i thought of channeling uh angel messages for you <laughs> but then my own you know like anyone else i'm human i have my own barriers to overcome so I, at one point I thought, who the hell are you to actually, you know, uh, channel uh, messages from angels. So I have a bit of an imposter syndrome myself. So <laughs> I'll be the first one to admit it um, because I'm, I'm just, I'm all about being uh, honest. Okay. See, so, yeah, and I'm scratching my nose, which means there's some truth to this. So they have been sort of nudging me to do these kind of topics which is what I'm going to be focusing on and uh, like I said if you are someone who is only into predictions then you might not like these kind of videos which is perfectly fine but I'm hoping to help uh, to create content that would help at least a few people out there uh, and it won't get lost in all the 20 million videos that you see in a month which are predictive in nature i have watched um i would say like if i watch more than five videos a day 
the next day I won't really remember much okay so that's not really helpful so it's very limiting to use uh, tarot and oracle cards and any sort of divination tool only to know what's going to happen in the future you know and you can get stuck in that sort of loop as well about constantly wanting to know what's going to happen rather than focusing on right what's right beneath your nose okay and missing that completely so you can actually change the future course of actions like i always say by focusing on the present uh by all means dream about the future uh i am a dreamer myself i have absolutely nothing against that do that but uh your present is all you have basically to make any sort of changes okay so um yeah i wanted to give you this little update to let you know that i haven't <laughs> disappeared and i haven't abandoned my channel or anything or i'm not having a mental breakdown or anything like that um i've just been taking some time out to rest and uh i've uh, been doing private readings but uh, yes uh i'm also interested in doing some videos that would um help you in the sense that i would probably talk to you about the kind of mistakes that i have made or <laughs> uh anything in general okay especially focusing on relationships and patterns that play out in relationships and things like that which uh, could help you okay um so i'm focusing more on the healing aspects of uh, divination and of uh, spirituality so that we can all evolve and grow and not ch- not just be fixated on that 7 days from now 15 days from now 1 month from now kind of um thing i'm not saying i won't do those i will but uh, these are the ones that i am currently being uh, guided to do and also focus more on okay uh, i'm not judging anyone let me tell you that so because i myself have watched a lot of uh, predictive videos and it's fun actually to cons- but what happens is that you're just consuming content that way like i said you won't really remember much and it's not going to really make that much of an impact on you so it's like it's okay for fun you know to uh to know if um <laughs> if uh something is likely to change or not on your trajectory okay so i'm leaving you here uh with uh, uh my best wishes and lots of love i hope you have a wonderful day evening night whenever you watch this and um, yeah do take care of yourself and uh, i will see you in um, these upcoming videos god bless namaste and bye bye